So after all the waiting, searching, and longing, have you finally found the one? Hi, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Sarah Woodard, a realtor here in Pierce County, Washington with EXP. And today we're gonna be reviewing how it feels to really find the one. So let's go ahead and talk about how you know for sure you found the home of your dreams. I've been in real estate for a little bit and I'm starting to put together some good indicators of when people have found the one. So one of the first indicators that you found the one is that you can't stop talking about it to your friends, your family, people at the store, your dog. When you look at other houses, you can't stop thinking about that other one. Bottom line, you compare every house to that one house and you're dying to go and walk through it once more, maybe a couple more times. But let's be serious, guys. When you are looking at a house, you want to make sure that it checks off everything on your needs list first, then maybe your wants list. You've started thinking about furniture arrangement. Yeah, all my feng shui people, you've already picked out where your couch is going to be. You're going to tear that wall out. You're going to put your desk over there. This is what this room is going to be. That defensive feeling you get about a house. That's how you know it's the one. Of course, guys, buying a house is not all about, you know, the warm butterflies and all of that. I understand it's got to fit your needs list, got to fit your wants list. And of course, above all, it's got to fit your budget. What are you guys able to afford? But above all, buying a house should feel exciting. Don't let anybody tell you different. I do just want to remind everybody that we are in a seller's market right now. It is currently April 10th that I'm recording this video and cash is still king when you are buying a house and that's something that buyers need to keep in consideration, the market that they are going into when they are buying a house. Want to experience the thrill of buying a home yourself? Go ahead and reach out. Let's get moving. What was your guys' last buying home experience? I want to know, have you bought a house before or not? Did something crazy happen or what do you wish that you did differently? Let me know in the comments down below. I'd love to hear from you guys. Don't forget to hit the subscribe and like button. I would super appreciate the love and support.